Hello friends, I am once again doing a draw view challenge thing because I am a loser with no original ideas. <laughs> no, but uh, they did this video where they were all given the same description of a character and then they had to design their own character based on it and they were like at the beginning anybody can follow along and do it too and so I was like heck yeah because anytime I see any type of challenge presented to me I will do it. Do not test me. Okay, so this is the first bit of information we have. Um, I'm imagining a girl, because I'm always down for swole girls, um, unless it says otherwise later on, but for now I'm thinking a girl. Um, okay, I'm thinking like a kind of dumb jock character, because it says built like a warrior, but it doesn't say they have to be a warrior, right? So, kind of like maybe like an Akane Oari character from like Danganronpa, just kind of a dumb himbo, but like my first thought was female, so. <laughs> Okay, soft green eyes and short, straight, light brown hair combed over. Okay. Like, a comb over or like just parted kind of like that? I don't know what hairstyles are, <laughs> but we'll figure it out. Okay, extravagant and revealing clothing. That kind of threw off my jock idea for a sec until I considered like, I've been getting into something that I used to do as a kid, a sport. Figure skating! <laughs> Those extravagant revealing, like, yes, it fits. It's a sport. It's a dancey sport, but it's a sport. <laughs> so, yeah, let's go with that. Um, yeah, a lot of costumes aren't super extravagant, but they definitely can be. Um, I actually started watching this movie, Blades of Glory, and, like, the costumes are so out there. Like, they're not realistic at all, but they're so cool. I haven't finished the movie yet, so, like, I don't know if I like it, but just the costumes are so cool. <laughs> Alrighty, I could have sworn I recorded, like, the reference image and, like, that, but okay. Uh, I referenced a picture of a girl, like, in roller skates for this. Um, so yeah, she kind of looks relaxed, like, irresponsible, but, like, she's talking to somebody else instead of, like, working on practice or whatever. Um, but also, the way the camera was, like, angled at the model I was referencing, it was, like, kind of upturned, so, like, you're looking up at her. So she kind of looks bigger that way. Um, so it kind of fits with the whole like warrior type of body. Um, yeah, I referenced some uh, figure skaters. I found this article that was like 30 most like risque outfits at the Olympics. So I was like, okay, <laughs> that's, oh yeah, there's the reference picture right there that I used to copy. Um, so yeah, I kind of just bullshitted my way through the skating dress. Um, just kind of low cut, just kind of sides gone. <laughs> um, yeah, so I did like the combed over sort of hair, um, it's not totally like a comb over, duh, because that'd be weird <laughs> for a figure skater, um, but yeah, usually figure skaters have long hair that are just like up, but like the short hair was cool too, um, I don't know if I've ever seen like a skater with like really short hair like that, um, anyway, <laughs> Not the point. So I kind of like made the ends go flip a bit. Like I know the description says the hair is like straight, but like no hair is totally straight, you know? So I don't know. <laughs> um, maybe that's cheating. I have no idea. Uh, so yeah, I just kind of tried to define the muscles. I cannot draw muscles at all. I suck. <laughs> um, her facial expression, again, kind of like she's talking to somebody over her shoulder and then her coach would be off somewhere like running door, like, hey, get back to work, kind of like, uh, she kind of gives me vibes of, uh, that one girl from, uh, Nozaki-kun, and then, like, the guy is always running after her, like, telling her to stop screwing around, yeah, that's the energy this girl gives me, <laughs> um, yeah, I, like, don't, I never know how to describe my own drawings, because I suck, <laughs> we've been new, um, but yeah, so, the skirt is just kind of normal, um, just standard figure skating sheer skirt. I don't know, I feel like everything that needs to be said was said like in the beginning when I decided all my plans and everything for this. Um, so I don't know. Uh, I kind of... I was thinking fire at first for the skater dress theme, but then I went with the blue to kind of go with the green eyes. Um, so yeah, it's more of like a watery, maybe icy sort of thing. I think it looks more like turquoise blue later on, so I think it's more of a watery sort of look. Um, so yeah, uh, that's kind of cool. 
I really kind of like how this dress turned out. The colors I ended up going with really reminded me of this one specific, like, Bratz, like, art image that I had in a book from my childhood. <laughs> um, so that's cool, I guess. <laughs> Also, like, I could have sworn I recorded the whole coloring process of this, but I guess I didn't, or, like, it just didn't work or something, so, like, it didn't get saved, uh, rip, but, like, the final image is still intact, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, that's kind of sad, because, <laughs> uh, yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, skates, I just hate drawing feet. Feet are the worst. Like, shoes, like, like, bare feet I've gotten the hang of, but shoes, no thank you. Stay away from me. Skates, don't even think about it. I I can't do it. No, I mean, I did. I just had to, like, duplicate one, so I'm cheating. <laughs> but yeah, um, here's the final image. I didn't do any shading or anything. I might do that in post. <laughs> Real drawfy hours, am I right? No. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that's about it. This turned out really short, but I hope y'all enjoyed it a little. Okay, see y'all later. Bye. <laughs>